sometimes I hey, this is Giant Lantern, and welcome to Let's Play Skyrim Part 12. On the way out of the city and headed towards High Rothgar, I bumped into this guy, and he wants me to find his family's sword. He fed his entire family with the gold he made using that weapon. I'm not about to let it gather dust in some thief's trophy room. Well, you're not going to have to worry about that now that I'm on the case. I tracked it to a group of bandits nearby, but I'm no fool. I'd need the White Run guards or maybe hire the companions to get it. No, no, man. You're just gonna need me. No problem. In your travels, I'd be grateful to you. If you find that sword, please bring it to me. So the goal is to head to High Harothgar, but the city's buzzing with activity. Lots of uh, things popping up right now. We're causing no trouble. All we ask is to look for her. Yeah, they're just asking to look for her. Jerk. Now get lost. We will be back. This is not over. You there. Me? Looking for someone in white run. We'll pay good money for information. A woman. A foreigner. Is it a pretty place. woman? Redguard, like us. She's likely not using her true name. We will pay for It's no problem. Trust me, I'll find her. We are not welcome here in White Run. I don't know, have you tried blending in? Maybe wearing a disguise might help. So I was just standing here and watching the uh, salmon jump upstream. Do you see those? It's so cute. Anyways, let's uh, head out. Come on, you punks, bring it on. Come on, yeah, show me what you got. You got nothing. Oh, yeah. Ah, uh, cooking with Johnny Lantern. Today we'll be making vegetable and venison stews. Well, now that I've finally found all the ingredients I need, I can make plenty of it. I mean, do you just see the stat um, boost you get for this? It's crazy! Look at that! That looks delicious. And we got some leftovers, so I might as well make some salmon steak. And some potato soup. And might as well make some rabbit haunch. I think that's how you say it. Who's there? Rodolph? That you? Oh uh, yeah, that's me. I was looking for you. Said he'd be up at the summit. Better not keep him waiting. So I wasn't really planning on going into any bandit places today, but I just get so distracted easily. And I'm really not gonna give up on a chance to get some sweet loot. <laughs> Honestly, I just feel bad for these poor rats being hung upside down. Sick bastard's gonna get what's coming to him. Just give up. Pow, right in the kisser. Look, I said it before and I'll say it again. Get off the table. Learn some manners. Jeez. So we had a blacksmithing potion. Of course not. Dogs I could train. But a half-starved wolf? Not a chance. Right. Lucky if it doesn't rip our throats out. Trust me, a wolf is the least of your worries right now. That's a grim reaper coming for you. Ooh, what's this chain here? Oh shit. Good boy, tear his throat out. That's a good boy. He's a easy wolf. Hey, leave my pet alone. Get your grubby hands off of him. Oh, you guys are gonna pay for that. It'll be so much easier to rob. Oh, what was that? Watch you guys. So you must be the bandit leader, the wolf and slave and asshole. I'm gonna get you, you bastard. Huh? Time to end this little game. Oh, not the face, not the fucking face! Eat your dessert. 
steel sword of ice cream slash. So honestly, I wasn't even looking for this sword and I found it. So quest done, sweet. And now I've returned peace to this hill and it's absolutely beautiful. Sometimes you just gotta stand back and admire the view. You gotta say that city looks peaceful from here. And as soon as I return to Whiterun, the weather's awful. It's just shitty. It. I've been looking for that blade for months. You took on all those bandits yourself? Yeah, you know. Here, my father had a favorite sword and shield technique. Let me teach it to you in honor of his memory. Well, as crappy as this weather is, you could definitely say I brightened I this guy's day. Things. Huh? Okay, forget it. Well, without any more interruptions, let's see if we can make it to High Rothgar. So we will continue on. And maybe level up if I feel like it later. So after avenging that wolf spawn comrade at the bandit hideout not long ago, he goes ahead and attacks me. What an asshole. Anyways, I came over this way because I was going to show you guys one of the standing stones. Um, it's got a really cool power. It lets you raise all the dead around you to fight for you for a short time once a day. I'm not going to get it myself, but I thought I'd at least show you guys where it was. Looks like I interrupted a necromancer doing his necromantic type thing. And I was going to leave him alone, but he attacked me, so, you know, got what was coming to him. So yeah, the uh, Ritual Stone, so if you're into necromancy, go ahead. So a ways back in Riverwood, the bartender told me about some bandit leader here. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and collect that bounty. I know, I've really gotta make it to High Rothgar, but I keep getting interrupted. But I can't help it, just more loot. And I get to show off my sweet bow skills. And as you can tell, I've been practicing a little bit, just a little. Gotta take these health potions, you never know when you need them. Alright, so these are the uh, infamous trigger traps. Um, if you don't, you know, undo the trap, and you just go and open the chest, you know, usually, you know, arrows or bolts or whatever will come flying at you, so just go ahead and unlock that before you uh, go ahead and open the chest. Go ahead, try and fight back! Yeah! Sword whip, kinda like a pistol whip. Use a butt end, you know. All right, here comes the bandit leader. Let's see if I can knock him off the bridge, make him fall to his own death. It's nothing. Really, because last time I was told I was a dragonborn. You won't save Skyrim alive, dude. You're not gonna leave this bridge alive. That's what you want. Oh yeah, this is what I want. Adios, motherfucker. And now for my secret ability. Summoning a second sword dual wield. Aw, oh, she's not ready for this. Over the edge you go. <laughs> Oh, this looks like a challenge. A little uh, bow on bow action. I think so. Well, Tom, Johnny's been training for quite a while, but it is a 200 foot shot. Will he make it? He made it! Crowd's gonna go wild! Ooh, nice find. Orcish bow of arsing and hunting bow of sparks. Sweet. Hey, if you enjoyed this video, please go ahead and hit the like button and show support by hitting subscribe. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day. Another bow? Nice.